Hello everyone and welcome to a early, very, well, not actually that early, really, kind of mid-morning, um, oh, ferret cam slash house tour video, loads of people have been asking me, that's Lady Shab's car, I'll have to remember to black out the license plate on that, loads of people have been asking me to do a new ferret cam and also a house tour, mostly the ferret cam, I'll be honest, so uh, this is gonna be that. Not sure how much of that outside you just heard. I was just coming back from the gym and it's Scotland. And so it's very, very dark, very, very late. Please excuse the ridiculous amounts of mess in here. This is the utility room and everything is gonna be messy. That's a bit of a heads up. I'm gonna take my wet boots off and I'll be right back. Okay, that's a little bit better. So I'm not gonna be treating mud into the house. That is Lady Sheila's computer. Big old doggo on it. Oh, lovely. All right, okay, so this is the new house. I'm not sure how well the camera's gonna be picking this up because the lighting's all kinds of weird. Ah, oh, cup of tea. Okay, it's kind of warm, so that implies that Lady Sheila might be up. Uh, so I'm gonna have to be cautious about recording this. But yeah, so this is the new house. I'm not gonna go through every single room, but we are gonna make our way up to the ferrets who haven't actually seen the house. They have been brought into the house because I didn't have it in me to leave them in the other house overnight by themselves. Sheila, I'm recording. Ferret Cam, say hello to YouTube. She's in there, I think. Hello, hello girls. Where's the light? I still don't know all of this yet. There we go. Hello girls. Hello, wake up. Hiya. Are you? You ready to come out yet? I think you probably are. Hey Siri. Oh, there you are, sweetheart. Having a big old yawn. Come on then. Oh, yawns. You're gonna roly poly against my hand. Yes, you are. Oh, I love you. We haven't played in like over a day. It's terrible. Oh, you're gonna roly poly out. Silly duke. There you go. Now, I'm going to let them run around this room. This is actually their bedroom now. This is entirely their room. And then, I'm going to introduce them to the rest of the house. I'm going to catch our own camera. Oh, sweetheart. <coughs> Love you. So, yes. Nadolik Shawin Paub. It is, in fact, Christmas Day. And as part of this video, I'm probably going to be opening some of the ferrets' presents. Some of which have been sent by Dapplings. Coming over here, Siri? No? You're too busy exploring. It's a new room with new smells. I mean, you're kind of used to the smells by now because you were in here all night, but it is still a new room. I have no idea how they're going to react to the amount of room that's in this house. There's only really one or two rooms and I'm not going to let them go in. More or less, all of the other rooms are going to be open to them all the time. The big one is the stairs. I'm not going to let them go into like the entry hall because yeah, I'm, I'm, their spines are made of liquid but their organs still pop if they fall really far. So they're not used to stairs. They've never, never had to interact with them. Maybe a caveat. No, too, too interesting. You kind of see that they're a little bit anxious. Their tails are floofy, like big old bottle brushes, because they're like, hmm, these are new smells, new place. Oh, uh, actually, no, you're okay. You, I'm gonna eat you. Come on. No, see how see how uh, how fluffed up her tail is. She isn't sure about this at all yet. New environment. Oh, where's Siri? Oh, she's wandered off. Come on over here. Kind of exploring. Hello, Caliad. No, too busy. Too busy, sweetie. Sometimes you can just defloof their tail by by stroking them, but no, she, she's actively remaining a little bit, a uh, little bit cautious. This is going to be a little bit before her tail goes down. So I'm going to let them have a run around and I'll probably just play with them on the floor a little bit. And then after that, we'll go and explore the rest of the house. It looks like she's having fun with the mirror, which is basically a walk-in wardrobe. But I think they've all calmed down just a little bit now. We've also got a Lady Sheila, well, or at least a Lady Sheila's feet. Hello? Hello? That's a radiator. <laughs> Lovely little dances. They're all doing it now. They're all they're all start, starting to uh, get happy with the room and just explore and play. 
Oh, you went the other way. Well done, you tricked me. That's like the, the dog. Uh, you throw the stick, but you don't let go, and the dog runs off. They did, literally just did that to me with the camera. You scallywags. But I don't think you should really be rummaging around in an open bag of litter, unless I really want to have to hoover the carpet straight away. There we go. Oh, look at them. They're so happy. Now, I'm going to pick them up, and now that they're happy with this room, we're going to go and explore another one. Maybe. Possibly. Are you coming with us, she lab? Yeah, I think so. Okay, we will see you downstairs. Okay, the girls are exploring the kitchen. Now this is one of the, the rooms they're probably going to spend a fair bit of time in, or at least when I'm in here, making food, they can wander around. They cannot go in there, because there are a million places where they can get behind things or under things and never come back until they're hungry. But that's probably not when I want them to be back. And this is the dining room, kind of. <laughs> it's a messy dining room. Look, the house is a bombshell, and it's probably going to be a bombshell for at least, I don't know, a week, maybe more. Yes, there's a big old carpet, and the presents. Yes, not yours though. Those are from my parents. Ah, uh, what are you looking for, Siri? Now, before anyone makes mention of the Cat5 cables just all over the place, yes, I know, they'll be sorted. The computer isn't going to be in here most of the time. <laughs> The computer is generally going to be in Lab's study. It's just that uh, this is one of the most available surfaces until we built a uh, desk, which we're probably going to be moving it later. Is that right, Shilab? Yeah. Okay. Have you found one of the little places that you can kind of almost get through? Yes, I think they have. But this is one of the big rooms that they're going to be in, and this room, and they're just they're just loving all of the clutter all over the floor. Not usually this messy, am I? Oh, I'd like to believe I'm not. Maybe, maybe I am this messy, and this is just going to be a first playground for the rest of days. Uh, but we've got a couple of uh, ferret, ferret toys, ferret presents. Some of these were um, left here by my parents before, uh, sorry, when they last came up. I think that's probably going to get their attention. We'll actually investigate this in a little bit, because I want them to enjoy uh, wandering around. But these were actually sent over by Carly Karma, which is lovely. This one's for the girls, and this one's for me. Come on then, I think it's high time that we go and explore the rest of the house. This is the games room, or what will probably be the games room. And we've already found the exercise bike. They're not going up inside the exercise bike and getting all on their heads. I'm not, not really a big fan of this myself, but uh, they seem to enjoy it. But yeah, this is the games room, slash music room, slash art room, slash general other hobbies room. Bookery knock, kind of. It's not really much of a book to be yet, there's no books in it. But eventually, this will be full of books, as will most of the house, because between Shelab and I, we've probably got enough books to fill this house. And here, I spotted someone sneaking in here. This is my, my study slash office slash, it was a bedroom, but now it's, it's my office. I've got an office that isn't the lounge. I'm very happy. Oh, also Bob Ross. Nothing like a little bit of Bob Ross on a Christmas morning, in my opinion. Oh, Callie had. Yes. Oh, she's dancing away. <laughs> Hello, Siri. Oh, they're in one of those moods. They're not going up the stairs? No, good. Hello, sweetheart. You enjoying? She's having a good old explore. But yeah, so now I've got a big old proper room. I'm going to be able to set up like a permanent green screen. I'm not going to have to take it down and put it up all the time, which means I'm going to be much more willing to uh, record and stream just at a moment's notice, I will be moving the search protectors up and like I've got um, like under table hanging things for them, but I haven't set those up yet. But normally, it's not possible for them to just wander over uh, search protector. Siri, Siri, sweetheart, carry out. I will follow you. No. Okay, <laughs> she's going for a wander. She's having a good old little poke around. This is the way back to your room, sweetheart. No, 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 no. Don't worry. I'd easily be able to catch her. She isn't that dumb. She'll just make a leap of faith. The biggest problem is if she's feeling a little bit spooked or her sisters jump at her. Then she might just war dance off the stairs, which is what I'm worried about. Come on, we've got other rooms to explore. And this particular bombshell is <laughs> what will eventually be the living room once all the furniture is assembled and like your TV's put up. I'm going to have to buy a TV. I don't usually use one. Um, but now we've got a big old living room, we can kind of have it like a console room and actually a living room instead of an office. 
Oh my goodness, the amount of stuff that you're going to be able to knock over until I fix all of this. I'm not, not a big fan, be honest. The girl's probably not going to be coming in here too much, just because, to be perfectly honest, I'm probably not going to be spending much time in here, I never do. It's like bed, my study, the kitchen, these are places that have a function that I actually make use of. I have got a ferret using me as a ladder to get to her presents. You're a very clever little girl, aren't you? But I've got very long arms. Oh, defeated! No, no, maybe not. No. Okay, well, we're going to be opening these presents together. You're, uh, are you more interested in the presents or the salmon oil? I honestly don't know. Uh, kind of both, I think. Kind of both. Right, well, let's open up Carly's present to the girls first, shall we? If I can do this with one hand. Maybe she'll have open in the corner there, keeping the girls... Uh, Keeping the girls a little less excited, kind of, maybe. Yes, Carly's maybe Oh, something. Oh, <laughs> she's a little bit anxious. Can you help me open this, girls? Can you help? Thank you. They're doing their best. Can you, can you open this for me? I've only got one hand, you see, and you've got mouths and claws and teeth. No, no, okay. No, no, no. Series, see, he's got it. You gonna open it? There we go. I'm training them to open presents. It's going to be grand. Now, this is a little, little like woolen, jingly, crinkly ball. It's, it's a knot. It's a knot of wool. And inside, there's a little crinkly present there. Um, this is basically uh, like, a, like a tinsel ball, I think. But we can just take out this and put in any kind of jingle ball we particularly want. Any, any small little jingle ball can be popped inside. In fact, Sheila, could you hand me uh, a small jingle ball from the cage? I think there's a couple in there. Do you want that, sweetheart? No, you want the, you want the ball? Or do you want the crinkly ball? No, 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 not too sure. Or do you want the paper? Maybe the paper. Because cause you're just, just a derp. You don't understand what is the present yet. Thank you. All right, okay. Let's get that inside. Now, hopefully, this will be entertaining for Siri if she actually pays attention. You want that? No? Whoosh. There we go. Oops, I had my finger in the way. Sorry about that. He's running away. She's enjoying that, I think. Oh, and Siri. No, well, Siri is usually the one for the jingle balls. See, the thing is, they're gonna love that because it's a bit of a puzzle for them. It's a puzzle for them to to try and work out how to get at the jingle ball inside. Anything that they have to kind of work out is great. There we go. Another big old jingle ball. Now, this is one of the ones for my parents. Ooh, do you want that one, Siri? Thinking about it, maybe. Do you want me instead? There we go. Siri loves to play football. Anything she can nose around, she adores. There we go. Oh, I think that is a hit as well. She still hasn't come out. <laughs> I'm fairly certain the uh, wool knot is also a hit. I might not see one of my ferrets for a couple of hours. Oh, oh right. Oh, she's come out. I think she, she's lured by the sound of the larger jingle ball. And this is just a little pack of jingly balls and tinsel balls. Siri's already trying to help me open it. I don't think you're going to be able to get into this one though, because th this one's a little bit more tough. This is not paper, this is plastic. You're going to give it a try. I'm going to help them out with both my hands, so I'll be right back. Okay, we got, no, no, you can't have the whole packet. You gotta wait. Greedy, greedy, naughty, greedy, no. Yeah, yeah, ah, <laughs> there you go, you silly bugger. Come on, there's all kinds of things in here. Do you want them? There's one, there's two. Uh, I think she just wants it all. Ah! She's won. Ah. You greedy sod. Greedy. Greedy bad sod. Uh, I've got a Siri around me. Hello, Cariad. Did you pop it in your Yep. That's right. You go off and wrestle, wrestle the, the toys away from your sister. She's trying to steal them all. That's right. Good. That'll keep him busy for a little while. Maybe long enough for me to get this feathery toy out of his packaging. Maybe. I think they're starting to get a little bit run down. I, I think if, if there was like HUD display for ferrets, their battery power would be up at like 40% right now. They've been bouncing around this house, even more so than I've actually shown because uh, sometimes <laughs> they get a little bit excited and then I have to drop the phone and run after them. Ah, uh, ferrets. Are you enjoying it up there? No, yes, kind of. 
Hello, Siri. Now, this is apparently for me, but you can help me open this as well if you want to, Siri. I, I think I need it. Need your help. Look, expert present opening skills. No, no, you're not interested because it's just for me. Well, that's just greedy. I'll help you open your presents, you scallywag. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, what did Carly send to Abac? Oh, oh. You can have the you can have the wrapping afterwards. Let's have a look. There we go. Oh, <laughs> a little little scarf. A little foxy scarf. Oh, that's lovely. Or is it a ferret? Hmm. Given the ears kind of stick up, I think I think it's probably more of a foxy scarf. Also, the the little colouring at the tail. Yeah. It's quite foxy. We can pretend it's a ferret scarf though. Oh, that's lovely. That's absolutely lovely. And you just I imagine you just uh, post the tail through there and then just oh, that's wonderful. It's the right time of year for this as well. Well, thank you so so much. Uh, that is so darling. And also, sounds like. Yes, they're still enjoying the bags. But that's going to be it for this Ferret Cam slash house tour video. Kind of house tour video. It's, you know, this is probably as close to a vlog as, as I'm going to have on my channel, or at least in the very near future. But that is going to be it from me. So I hope you all enjoyed and are having a lovely, lovely holiday. Whether, in fact, you do celebrate any particular holidays or you're just enjoying a, a nice long weekend. Either way, I hope it's a good one. And I will see you in the next video. So until next time, take care. I kind of lied. The moment they were put back in here, they just jumped in the cuddle cups. They were definitely low on energy. Their batteries were running low, and now they're like, ah, sleep time now. Sleep time till, till like at least 8 p.m., then wake up and bounce around the house again a little bit more. So this is actually the end of the video now, this time, properly. Take care, everyone. I hope you have a wonderful weekend.